hello one everyone this lecture is related to proof of pseudo first order reaction from lagrangian n order reaction we know that lagrangian n order reaction is change in qt with respect to time is equal to k n q e minus q t to the power n this n show the order of reaction for pseudo first order reaction the n is 1 it is not the first order but oh, it is the say actually actually it is second order reaction but we make it first order reaction which is pseudo first order reaction so for pseudo first order reaction n is equal to 1 the this can be equal to 1 so dq t is equal to dt is equal to k1 q e minus q t power 1 now this q e is the equilibrium of take q e is the equilibrium of take of take of catalyst or of adsorbent similarly the q t is the of take at any time at any time adsorbent uptake at any time qt and this is the equilibrium uptake of the adsorbent and k is the pseudo first order rate constant k1 is the rate constant and we can also obtain the rate constant from simple relation which is nsr kca to the power n this is the rate constant so the linear form of this equation is the suppose this is equation one this is equation number two we can obtain the linear relation of this equation or by simple integration qt qe minus qt k to d t take the integral on both sides we will get qt qe minus qt equal to k dt time t when we take the integral we will get at time 0 the there is no uptake qt is equal to 0 uptake qt at time t is equal to 0 qt is equal to 0 at time t is equal to t q is equal to qt so this is qt so take the in the integral of this is minus ln q e minus q t 0 to the t is equal to k into t so simply put the integral the limit we will get minus ln q e minus q t minus ln q e minus 0 is equal to k 1 and 2 t now it is further simplify it minus ln q e minus q t plus ln q e is equal to k1 t so ln q e minus q t is equal to now this is uh, ln q e minus k1 t when we simplify this it will come to this side it will minus and uh, we will get ln q e minus k t so this is the linear form of the pseudo first order model now if we uh, make a graph between the graph will like this 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 is the y intercept of the line and this is the the slope of the line this is the slope of the line this is the x which is time it can be meant on in hours and this is the ln q e minus q t sorry this is the ln ln q e minus q t on the y axis so a graph can form like this this is the y intercept is ln q e this is the ln q e the y intercept 
from the y intercept we can obtain ln from y and from the y intercept we can obtain the equilibrium of echo and q is obtained from the slope of the line k1 is the slope and this is the y axis which is ln q e minus q t thanks